Somebody said every arm takes like a hundred years, but that's a little overstated, I guess, from what someone else said, but either way. Wow. And this has got to be 35 feet tall. Butterfly oasis here. The only standing water anywhere near us is chock full of, of larvae and other things that are sprouting and drawing lots of these great little butterflies. Hey George, I think we found Rovi's needle. What do you think, honey? It's pretty out here. Quiet. Flowers everywhere. Green. And Weirdly so green, green, yeah. I don't know how well it translates, but it's just amazing. Flowers and greenery in the middle of the desert. Up at Rovi's Needle. Mm -hmm. Pretty cool spot. Mm -hmm. Gorgeous hike. The hike basically comes up <clears throat> through this little uh, gorge down here, winds its way on up. Kind of climbing up a waterfall. Yeah, you've got to go up a couple of spots that are pretty, a little bit of a climb, but not too horrible. And no water right now, so it's not a big deal that way. Pretty awesome. First shots are up through here. I mean, this whole thing, one big sliver through this middle section of it, all the weight sitting on this one thin strip right here in the middle. And then the whole thing goes way up from there. People can come out here with Jeeps. And there's some folks uh, there that were hanging out when we got here, and now they're heading down. 
feet for four wheelers a dozen times, you can see that we hiked. <coughs> Come on up, hon. Oh, God. <laughs> Yeah, you can imagine again how many how many people have camped out here over the centuries. Yep. Mm. All right. Well, after a really beautiful hike up here to <laughs> Rovi's Needle, got the place to ourselves now. We're just kind of kicking back and enjoying the peace and the quiet and the birds and the bees and the it's really pretty up here it's just perfect